So now summer is coming to an end, which also might mean your summer fling is coming to an end. How do you now transition into the colder winter months and maybe find a more serious relationship? I'm here with Tracy Steinberg, the datologist, to tell us a little bit more how to make that transition. I really recommend that people take the time to do the introspection and figure out what is important to them and what isn't important to them. That no one should ever settle for a serious relationship when the other person is not healthy, confident, and available. And then you figure out what are your five non-negotiable traits that if if this other person did not have, that you wouldn't feel satisfied with them. Well, does that mean for a summer fling, they don't have to have those five traits? Well, it really depends what you're looking for. I mean, if you're just looking to have fun, then the most important aspect for the other person is that they're fun. But if you're looking for someone to actually snuggle with in the cold winter months, Maybe it's cold outside. it's just going to be the two of you. And, uh, you know, you actually want to like the person and enjoy spending time with them and have it be free of drama. Do summer flings ever really work? I mean, everyone's always got that one summer fling they remember, whether it was from their college years or afterwards or before, even back in high school, when times just seemed like a lot more free and fun. Do those ever really last? I think that they can last. And I'm sure that everybody listening knows somebody who's been able to make the summer fling last. But in general, if you're choosing a relationship based on the fact that they're going to be fun for the summer, often that doesn't necessarily translate to become a serious relationship. So let's say you're going out on a date in September, October. Do you find that this is the time, and should women be aware that this is the time that men are maybe looking for something a little more serious, or should women be aware of this? As a dating coach, I definitely notice that people come to me when they are thinking about getting into a serious relationship. And I definitely have seen in my business that I attract more people wanting help in the fall months. And it's probably because they know that snuggling with uh, <laughs> hot chocolate by the fireplace, they, they want a cutie to do that with. For more tips on finding that perfect relationship, now it's getting colder. Check out Tracy Steinberg, the datologist, on her website at tracysteinberg.com.